Hello, my name is Brett Lockspeiser. I'm a senior front-end engineer at our research, the team behind Unpaywall. And today I'd like to give you a quick tutorial of how you can fix errors that you might find in the Unpaywall dataset. So here we are on the Unpaywall website. You'll notice in the header, as well as a button on the home page that will let you fix an error. So let's click on that. Um, this form has now got, is a new form that'll help you correct the open access statics for articles and journals in Unpaywall. Let's start with an article. So to look up an article, we need to know it's DOI. If you're not familiar with the DOI, this is a digital object identifier. It tends to look something like this. And this is the ID that lets us look up any article on the Unpaywall database. So for any landing page in an article that you find on the web, you should be able to find a DOI listed on that page. So let's go ahead and start with a particular DOI and look up an article. Okay, so this article PV metal roofing module, Unpaywall currently thinks that this work is paywalled. So if that's not correct, and in fact it's free to read, we can click free to read. In this case, we're just going to ask you for um, the link where you can find this article online. Because if it's open access, we need to have a link that points to that PDF that people can actually read. So let's enter in a link and click save. And now we can see we are adding an open access link and reporting that this article is actually open access. So when you submit your reports, optionally you can add your email address um, to the report. You don't have to do this, but it helps in case we need to follow up with any questions about your report. So I'm gonna add my email address and hit Submit Fix. And there we go, we've fixed one article. So let's try another DOI for another article. I'm gonna paste that here and look it up. Okay, so we've looked up this article here. This one, Unpaywell thinks, is currently free to read at this link at the publisher. Um, but my might have checked this link and it's actually blocked, and it's, it's actually paywalled. In that case, I can just click no, it's paywalled, to report that this article is actually paywalled. I'm going to click undo for a second just to get us back to here and say another case is that maybe this article really is free to read, but this link is wrong. And if that's the case and I have the correct link, I can click this link is wrong and I can go in here and make a correction to the link, hit save, and now I can submit a report that says that this, um, the correct open access link is this one that I've just entered right here. I'm gonna go back to the start for a second here, and now let's look at the journal case. So I'm gonna click fix a journal. To look up a journal, we're gonna use its ISSN number. So let's paste in a particular journal here. So we wanna fix this journal. So this journal on Paywall currently thinks is closed access. If that's not true, actually it's open access. Click the big green button. And the one thing we're just gonna to wanna to know here is, is it the case that this journal has always been open access or did it change to become open access at some year in the past? So let's just say it was since 2020, this journal became open access. I can hit save and see that I'm gonna report that this journal is open access since 2020 and I can submit my fix. Great, let's look at one last case for the journals, let's see another ISSN. So I'm gonna go back to journals and do ISSN. This is a journal that Unpaywall currently thinks is open access. If that's not correct, just hit the big red button, report that this is actually closed access, submit your fix, and you've added some information for us. Um, if you have another error that you found in some of our data that doesn't match any of these cases, just click on this button here to report another error, and you can send a support ticket to support at unpaywall.org um, to make sure we get any other errors fixed up for you. Um, so that's it for now. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, appreciate any reports you make or helping to clean up this data set, both for yourself and for all the other people who are making uses of Unpaywall. Thank you.